Hi, I'm Clara Halpin and welcome back to the Highlands Gallery for our next workshop, which is going to Brownies for Tea. So it's going to be a mixed media workshop. We're going to start by having a look at an artwork in the current exhibition. This is an artwork by Cathy Tyne called the Yellow Roses. I want you to take a quiet moment to have a look at this artwork and see what do you see? What is going on? Okay, so when we were looking at this in the gallery a couple of weeks ago, we thought maybe somebody was calling over to somebody for tea. We thought it was maybe daughter going over to her mammy, or maybe a granddaughter going over to her granny. We looked around the picture and we thought maybe the daughter or granddaughter was going someplace special. She looks like she's all dressed up. Then somebody thought them she might have a wig on. Look, you can see her dark roots. Maybe she's not a natural blonde after all. And then we looked behind Granny and the granddaughter and we looked, we could see a garden. Oh look, there's some more cards up there. Maybe it was a special occasion for the Granny. Maybe she's, maybe it's her birthday. And maybe they're having tea. And maybe some cakes. There's a few biscuits there on the table. Not much. But we might have a look and see, is there, oh look, there's more biscuits there on the bottom right hand corner. Then we were looking at what was on Granny's lap and we thought, oh look, she might be interested in dogs. Because look, that looks like a book about dogs or maybe it's another birthday card. Then somebody noticed that the Granny might be in a wheelchair. If you look just over the, her right shoulder, you can just see what looks to be the handle of a wheelchair. So we thought this was nice that somebody was calling over, maybe to help her out, to bring her tea, and to have tea. When we were having this conversation a couple of weeks ago in the gallery, little did we know how tricky it was going to be now to go and see our grannies, go and see our mammies, and just to call over to somebody for tea. Because we miss doing that. And we really want to try and do it again. So in the meanwhile, what we're going to do is, for the multimedia workshop, we're going to make a room and bring everyone over to tea. All of our family and all of our friends. So after this, I hope you got your materials gathered together. We're going to start making. So we've all our materials together. I found with this project that different sorts of papers and newspapers, magazines, catalogues, little catalog worked really well for this project. Okay, so first up, take your A3 sheet, fold it in half crossways, and then you're going to open it up again, and you're going to fold up about a third from the bottom. And once again, open it back up again. And you're going to cut just up to that third line. And then these are going to fall on the walls of our room. So you can start adding in some coloured paper for the floor, a bit of home decor, a bit of DIY, and then start maybe thinking about, well, what's going to go on the walls? You can do different colour walls. You can start decorating the walls, wallpaper, add a little window in here. And then out of the little catalogue, cut some flowers from the Mother's Day catalogue. And then started adding in some couches. So losing the run of myself here with the home decor. And these were taken from the Harvey Norman catalogue, a bit of product placement there. And then we started trying to make the table. So that's using a long strip of cardboard, kind of fold it together in an Ikea way. Bit of a table cover in there. And now we just need to add our goodies, all cut out of our catalogue. So, um, there should be a picture of our goodies there. And then, all we need is our host. Here's Granny. And Granny is just making, I just drew Granny, cut her out, leave a little bit extra underneath her feet so that you can fold her feet back and stand her up. Now, she's all ready to go. It's tea time at Granny's. So you need to make all the other guests decide who's coming over. 
You can pop them on the couch, pop them up beside the table, and um, we're all set for a deep party. So good luck with your project. Let us know how you get on. And please do send images of everything you make to thehighlinesgallery.ie for our online exhibition.